leader and part of the leadership group believe that Willie is still the, the right guy for, for this team moving forward? Absolutely. It's, uh, it's never been a question about that uh, from, from this team. Um, we, we really like him as, as a coach and as a, as a person. and uh, He's really good to work with. So uh, that's, that's never been a, a, a question from, from any of the players uh, uh, from, since day one. You know, last year opened a lot of doors for me, and um, but I wanted to be loyal and, and, and stay here because I thought, you know, you know, we're one of the best power players in the league. Uh, Dan and I were playing really good hockey, and I thought that's going to keep going, and um, so I decided, you know, to stay here and, and um, you know, um, take this opportunity and go with it. And you know, first day of camp uh, when you set as number seven, it's it's kind of frustrating. You know, you go from being a top four to being your seventh defenseman over the summer within without anything happening. So it was, uh, it was kind of a bit of a struggle from the start. Did you regret that loyalty? Uh, it's easy to say no. I mean, um, you know, uh, last year after the season, everything sounded so positive, you know, from here. And uh, I was really happy how things were going. Um, things were looking so bright. And, um, you know, I, you know I, I thought, you know, the season's going to just keep going how it ended last year. But, you know, unfortunately it didn't. So. We'll just move on from that. We, at that time, we I had opened myself to being available to the top teams in the league, and um, you know a deal wasn't done. And we're at the end of it. We stayed here, and we're very happy to be here. And um, you know, certainly, it's been challenging in the last, uh, I guess, six weeks, and, and not uh, you know not making it, and you know now and then being quite far out of it in the last couple of weeks. And um, but you know that's. Uh, this is the position we're in, is trying to make the best of it. Um, I think, uh, obviously, at a uh, young age, stepping into a second line center role, it's definitely not easy. Um, you no, know, I think, uh, you know, when Setsi went down, it definitely took a toll on not just me, but the team. And uh, it was definitely tougher, uh, obviously, adjusting to it. It took me a little bit of time to, you know, even the, you know, everybody a little bit of time to adjust to it, you know, getting lines right, getting. You know, systems right and everything. We got some new guys in the lineup, so um, yeah, it was just uh, it took a little bit of time for everything to get adjusted, and um, I just found uh, it just took me a little bit of time to to find my game, find my role, and and um, you know, I found once I did that, it started to you know, uh, started to go my way. I mean, Alex and, and Hammer and myself, Daniel, uh, throughout the, the the older guys, so there's there's been more. Uh, We've been more vocal for sure, and uh, that's uh, it. Comes to us caring, like like Alex said. It's we, we care about the young guys. We want them to do well here, uh, even after we're done. They're going to be here for a long time. So, but you have to start with a good foundation, and uh, even if it doesn't mean if we're not going to make the playoffs this year, but going forward, they, they need to have the foundation. Otherwise, it's uh, it's not going to turn out well.